here's another video response to help you guys out in today's society and trust me you'll thank me for this one as I would consider it personally myself a life hack in order to protect one's peace of mind along with peace of heart do not and I repeat do not get with a woman that's doing everything within her worldly power to try to distract you by dressing any way she can or better yet don't get with a woman that is willing to spice up your bedroom life by dressing in particular ways because I can guarantee you now these are nothing more than soul ties that she developed with other men within her past now if you are if you are on what's the word I'm looking for uh, unable there you go if you are unable to what's the word I'm looking for discern there you go if you are unable to spiritually discern a real feminine sexually pure woman from a woman that has soul ties connected to other men don't get with her I'm telling you now I don't care how much hate or how much peer pressure she applies onto any of you involved do not and I repeat do not get with her she's got to learn a viable life lesson that her demonic influences are going to catch up with her and quite literally tear her life apart while you guys are actually set free from her clutch, her grasp in here and in here consider this, you know another chance at life it's going to be uncomfortable for a while to those of you that don't understand it but you can only grow and evolve from it it is what it is and like I said you would know trust me whether you found a real woman or not a rarity given today's day and age I mean if she's willing to do all of these things as described within the video but yet she's sexually pure and she's feminine and a bundle of joy to be around and she's not putting on some front nor act to try and dupe the male species into believing a bullshit then I'm telling you now You've got yourself a keeper. Me personally, I'm able to spiritually discern just exactly who's putting on a front, who's putting on an act, and who are actually, in fact, being real, along with genuine. It is what it is. So, you know, these uh, circus clowns, as I'd like to call them, <laughs> you know, these circus clowns, they got nothing on me. You know, they might get these victory wins in, sure, you know. But they're fooling themselves. Because, like I said, these victory wins that they get on me are only going to be added on to their lifespan, thus, in fact, shortening their lifespans. And they'll have no choice but to rage quit and drop from my radar. It is what it is.
Me personally, I love the knowledge that I learn just by going inside of here and in here when involving female psychology. I mean, I'm bound to hurt as well as piss off a lot of you men out there, but I don't give a shit. I would rather hurt and piss off you men with the truth that actually, in fact, butter you up with sugar-coated, sweet-for-nothing, lies disguised as truths, which is what many people do nowadays. It's just how I roll, man, you know? It's how I roll. And I love learning. You know, I love learning. As a matter of fact, I don't want to stop learning, no matter how challenging it gets. Because like I said, it does mean going inside of here and in here in regards to getting the information out there to put a stop to this blue pill society that's deliberately failing men and also the opposite sex. Where there is guaranteed to be a global collapse. Birth rates will begin to plummet. Marriages will begin, begin to decline even, as well as decrease within significant numbers. There is going to be a global crash. And my blessing and my reward is watching the shit show unfold before my very eyes, laughing at the very expense of the devil, inwardly that is. As I go along my day, doing my own thing. It is what it is, man. And another key piece of advice to you guys would be... Know this, at the end of the day... If you think for one minute that your friends are your real friends, and your family members are actually, in fact, your real family members, you're in for one rude awakening. When reality hits, I'm telling you now, because they are nothing more than enemies disguised as frenemies. They're just putting on an act. They're putting on a, a show to fool you into believing that they are actually, in fact, who they claim to be, when little did each and every one of you know there's no truth to their false images. And if you dig deep enough, and you use these godly lenses, you will be able to see it for yourself, as well as sense it for yourself. And if your connection to your soul is actually in fact potent, you can also decode the spiritual masks people wear. I've had occasions where I've quite literally pried people's spiritual mask right off their face just by grasping like that within midair. No joke. You can call me crazy, call me whatever you like. I don't give a shit. I know the truth. And those of you that are trapped and enslaved to the Blue Pill Society, I'm free from it. And ironically, it's those that are trapped and enslaved to the Blue Pill Society that consider us the crazy ones, when in actuality and reality, we are the woken ones. We are awakened to the bullshit within today's society. And just exactly how the devil operates, what spiritual tactic, or should I say tactics, he uses in regards to sway people from their faith, along with oneness monotheistic relationship commitment witnessed and approved by the Holy Spirit and there you have it guys trust me you'll thank me for this one stay tuned for more videos and most importantly like I said don't get with a woman that so happens to do everything within the relationship to convince you to stay with her. I don't care how good looking, you know, she's brainwashed you into believing she is. It's nothing more than an empty meat suit. 
real talk. It's nothing more than an empty meat suit. Hiding behind... Hiding behind a false image, even. A false god. A false idol. And this is why so many of you guys out there within today's society are trapped within these rela uh, relationships, even. Because you've given so much of your power away to these said women that it's not even remotely funny. You've actually forgotten who you are. But you can take all of that back faster than the click of a finger, man. No joke. But it will take a lot of work. A lot of calculating. Planning, prepping. And no, I'm not referring to grabbing yourself a pen and a piece of paper as in planning and prepping. I'm talking about planning and prepping in here and in here. It takes a lot of work. But know this at the end of the day. No one, and I mean no one, has power nor control over you guys. They only have the power and control if you continue to give them that power and control. But if you take the power and control back by cutting off these said soul ties, your lives will begin to improve drastically. And you will see the benefits, like I said, in here and in here. You're not going to see them overnight. You're not even going to see them within 6 hours, 12 hours. It's a lifetime commitment. And it does take a lot of hard work and sacrifice. But within time, all of that hard work and sacrifice that you made will be blessed greatly via the fruits that you harvest as your reward. Just like every bad deed, there's a punishment and a consequence to anyone that commits said bad deed, yeah? Just like a good deed. Not from a self-righteous, ragged work, rather a righteous work, right? Where there's a righteous work, there is also a blessing and a reward, spiritually and psychologically. Like I said, you might not see said blessing and reward like that, but within time, you will. The presence of the Lord works in mysterious ways, man. Truth be told. 